My name is Alina Sankara and I did my bachelor's degree in photonic science and engineering at the University of Central Florida at their College of Optics and Photonics. IMLEX is an Erasmus Mundus master's degree that specializes in imaging and light in extended reality. Um, the main focus of my studies at UJM are computational imaging because I'm in the computational track of the program. Um, one of the domains that I would like to specialize in in the future is uh, displayed technology for virtual reality headsets. Uh, and I can do a lot of this with both physical hardware and software, which I'm learning a lot about here. <laughs> I chose an Erasmus Mundus degree because I wanted to travel more and see the world of engineering from an international perspective. Um, there's a lot that you don't really know about and you can't really see just from living in the same state your entire life, living in the same country um, and seeing the different countries and their engineering fields from that perspective. You can learn a lot about um, how different contributions to the in engineering industry were made and how they're changing the future of extended reality and all kinds of engineering aspects. So last semester in Finland, I was able to learn a lot about optics and photonics and a lot of new things that I might have not been able to interact with in my undergraduate degree. Um, this semester at UJM, I'm able to learn a lot about software and computational imaging and image processing and lots of other kinds of technology that uh, I wasn't able to touch on at all when I was an undergrad. In Japan, I'll be able to learn a lot about different kinds of technologies and things like robotics and other applications that might not interact directly with the field of extended reality, but also have many applications in those fields. This summer, I'd like to do research at one of IMLEX's partner universities in Belgium. Um, KU Leuven is in charge of IMLEX's lighting track, and the students there are more in charge of working with physical hardware and uh, more optics-based technologies. And the reason that I'd like to do research there is just so that I can combine some of the knowledge I've learned here at UJM pertaining to computational imaging with more of those physical hardware-based applications that I focus more on in my undergrad. The Manutex Light Graduate School has many different kinds of opportunities, including cutting-edge research facilities and different kinds of technologies that are available for, for students to use. Um, I was also offered a scholarship by the Graduate School to help start a student chapter. Uh, and this would basically be an organization for the students to help uh, organize more professional and social events. In my bachelor's, I was the vice president of the Society of Optics Students at the University of Central Florida, and I'm trying to use some of that knowledge I learned from then to help start the Manutech Light Graduate School student chapter. Um, and we're mostly working with optics and photonics based organizations. The main one that we want to work with is Optica, and we want to create a student chapter of that in order to create a more connected network between optics communities and students here at the graduate school. The computational imaging track of IMLEX has many benefits, one of them being being able to study at UJM. Um, and this track is more focused on being able to render and visualize images in real time. And these are a lot of uh, courses and opportunities that I wouldn't be able to experience at any other university, primarily due to the hardworking and dedicated staff that's so committed to the success of the students here. After I complete IMLEX, I would like to work in the industry in order to gain more real-life knowledge about uh, the field of extended reality today and what kinds of new technologies they have to offer. And hopefully I'll be able to contribute some of those technologies to this ever-growing industry. I would absolutely recommend studying at UJM, mainly due to the dedicated staff that are always there and um, are always pushing me to gain more success in my life. Uh, and I've greatly enjoyed living in Saint Etienne for the past four months. While it can be a little difficult to get around without knowing French sometimes, it's a very beautiful and lively city and it's full of very friendly people. So I've loved living here. <laughs>